Well, Valentine's Day is the most romantic time of the year. People typically show their affection with special gifts for loved ones. Teresa De Young is live at Rev's Candies with how businesses, I knew you'd find your way there, are handling the holiday. Tracy? <laughs> Well, hello, Denise. Businesses are cashing in on Valentine's Day. According to the National Retail Federation, about the average consumer will spend about $144. And businesses say most of their customers are actually men, not women. <laughs> Love is in full bloom at Raymundi's Floor Shop in Baltimore County. I am buying a dozen roses for my wife. Roses are the flower of choice yeah. for Valentine's Day. Raymundi's florist orders more than 50,000 of them, and they're usually sold out by the end of the day. Most people have a partner, or they have a mother, or they have a grandmother, or a sister. This is also the busiest day since many customers wait until the last minute. Women plan ahead, men don't. They think about it. Oh, Today's Valentine's Day. Oh, I, I better get something. From ordering the flowers to designing the arrangements, it typically takes about two months to prepare for a holiday this big. Love is also on the menu at Rye Street Tavern in South Baltimore. It's a special night. People that might not dine out every weekend come out on Valentine's Day. It's a special day. The restaurant will be packed with couples sharing an intimate dinner. Here at Rye Street Tavern, they started to prepare about a month ago. The chefs chose specific dishes that you can only get on this special holiday. Things like stone crab claws um, for dessert, chocolate fondant, um, and, uh, and things are really fun to, to share. And Love is keeping Reb's Candies in southwest Baltimore extra busy. More people come through on Valentine's Day itself than probably any other day. Some customers waiting more than an hour for their sweethearts. Well, it's the best place in town, and she likes it. So she deserves it. I'll get it. For many, Reb's Candies is a Valentine's Day tradition, but customers still procrastinate. On, on this day, all men, all working people who, same thing. Oh, it's Valentine's Day. I got to get in there. Okay. Reb's Candies saw about 700 customers today. They typically only see about 150 of them. And here's a look at their best seller. This is the Jimmy Truffle. They sold about 150 pounds today. That is a lot of truffles that people are enjoying all over the city. Reporting live, Tracy Leong for WJZ. Ooh. 150 pounds here, 150 pounds, yeah. Thank you, Tracy. <laughs> According to the National Retail Federation, 55% of Americans will celebrate Valentine's Day. That's a lot of chocolate. Yeah. That is a ton of chocolate. <laughs> Do you love chocolate?